Hello everyone, Ian Earl, AK Senior Everything here, and I know that this is a um I know this is a bit of a rushed video, but there's something that I need to say and something that I need to put out here. I'm a little bit late to the punch, uh to really break this story, I guess, but that's not really my goal. My goal is to let you guys know that a fellow YouTuber, an extremely good quality YouTuber by the name of Anthony Fantano, is under attack by this huge news I think it's a music news conglomerate type deal that called his meme channel, that is a plan, uh, that it had a, a secret alt-right agenda. Now obviously this is ridiculous, I've seen a bunch of his videos, they're all jokes, there's nothing in there that could even be somehow construed as alt-right, they were cherry-picking the evidence, um, their claims, I guess. Oh, yeah, also, I'm outside now, that's because, uh, there was a bunch of noise and stuff going on outside, so I inside I guess so I decided to go outside there we go nope sun is at the uh there we go um yeah so guys just to let you know you know and uh, be due to this not only was his tour canceled because you know the uh the article bullied a lot of headlining um lo uh ran re what's the word crap fuck ran v venues jeez don't know why that took so long and, um, and, uh, the booking agent, uh, they essentially, they put a bunch of pressure on them to cancel it, and also even if they didn't, uh, you know, there, there was so much, like, it, it got, the article blew up, so they, they wanted to protect their identity, um, and, uh, so essentially, Fader released this article, the needle drop responded, um, I don't think he knew how bad it was going to get, and, um, then it got really bad, uh, so, he had to delete his That Is A Plan channel, because he was getting so much hate and stuff from it, from the people who read the Fader article, uh, he, uh, so not only did he have to delete his channel, which, by the way, had, like, 350,000 subscribers, so it was a pretty big channel that he was uploading to pretty regularly, I loved it, I thought that it was hilarious, uh, he was, he had some very, very funny, he put on this character in it, you know, and it was, it was great, um, and he did this, uh, my favorite series was The Greatest Rapper, where essentially he just mocked all these rappers, uh, I, I liked the 90s kid episode, so it, it was a great channel, and he had to delete that, and now he can't go on his tour, and so, one, he's losing money that he would have gotten from the tour, and two, he just lost a huge channel, so not only is this a big blow to him and his persona, and essentially everything that his YouTube career is all about, but it's also a big blow to everything that, to essentially, that's a huge blow to his revenue. I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure that he's not going under from this or whatever. But guys, I'm, I'm pretty sure he, had a, he has a Patreon. If you it, go to his Patreon, support him. If not, just watch his videos. If you haven't already subscribed to The Needle Drop or Fantano, which is his third channel, but now is his second because that is the plan is gone, go subscribe there. Essentially, just give him a bunch of love, guys, because this is this is one of the worst things that can ever happen to a YouTuber. So, well, besides losing their contract with Disney and having season two of their YouTube Red series canceled. <laughs> um, anyway, anyway, so guys, just help him out there. Give him some love. I love that channel, and it's awful to see a fellow YouTuber go through something like this. Uh, I'll have links to his um to his, crap, what's the word, I'll have links to his channel, to his two channels, and then to his Patreon down below, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.